Good. That's Very great. good. Very good. The 11th annual Taste of Rhinebeck was a huge success. Many participated in sampling small plates of delicious fare. No. I'm say this for and many enjoyed palate pleasing beverages. Because we support the Cheers. cause. <laughs> Enjoy. Do you want a taste? Uh, okay. <laughs> Over $23,000 was raised to support existing and new health care services at Northern Dutchess Hospital. Well, lots of docs participate, board members, but most important, the community. The community comes to support the hospital, support the event, and it's really it's a fun time for all. And here's how the evening worked. Over 500 people registered for tonight's event, and each were given a map with a listing of over 20 businesses in the area to get a little taste of Rhinebeck. So by the time people go around, they've had a lot of little bits. <laughs> oh my gosh, you would think all those little snacks along the way don't fill you up, but about halfway through you are, you are full. You have an opportunity to take a nip here, a nip there of alcoholic beverages, but after the night's over, um, believe me, you don't leave here hungry. By the time you get to your last spot, you don't want any more to drink or any more things to eat, even though you think you can do it. <laughs> but by the time you're at the end, you're like, forget this. But the Taste of Rhinebeck not only supports the hospital, but it brings the community together. It's one of our fundraisers, but it's what we call a fun fundraiser. It's probably the most enjoyable one. And I equate it to trick-or-treat for adults. What brings you here to Taste of Rhinebeck? Well, of course, the good food, but in company with my sisters and mom, that's the best part. What's your favorite part? Trying new food, meeting new people, and the whole camaraderie that, that is experienced here every year. And a new category this year, the Ira Gutner Award. It was named after a dedicated local businessman. He died literally like a week before our event last year. He loved Taste of Rhinebeck and all of his friends and family said, oh, you have to do it, you have to do it. So we still did it last year, even though we had flowers out front on the bench. We really felt we needed to do something to honor his spirit. Taste is a very special event for me now because it was so special to be here that night and just feel all the love and support from the community for what we do here. Each participant was given a card where they got to pick their favorite restaurant. And for Ginny Schwab, it was a tough decision. I love the Indian food. I was surprised. It was curry with chicken. It was delicious. Oh, goodness. I love the dark chocolate. And then we had uh, some Greek food I loved. Yeah, I, there's nothing I haven't loved. <laughs>